Hey everyone, Izzy and MJ from Endless RVing. So as you may know, one of the big costs in RVing is the cost of fuel. And fuel is more expensive than it has been about three years ago or so. It's coming down a little bit, but it's still more expensive. And starting the new year, a lot of times gas taxes are adjusted state by state. So in this video, we're gonna talk about how that may affect you. It could save you money, or it could be costing you more money. This article comes from rvtravel.com. It's dated December 28th, 2023, and it is titled Fuel Tax Rates Change with New Year. Will you be hit? So as Izzy said, some will, some won't. So let's talk about the ones, the states that will be ringing in the new year with a little hike. Now, this will be a penny or less for the following states, Florida, Georgia, Nebraska, New York, and North Carolina. So other states will see higher rates. Michigan will bump the rate up to 1.4 1. cents. Now, th that's not how much tax. Their, their tax is actually way more, but they're increasing at 1.4 right. cents. And that's uh, tied directly to the Consumer Price Index. So in the state of Michigan, the tax rate on both gasoline and diesel is going to hit 30 cents per gallon. Oregon will beat Michigan. Traveling the West Coast state will rise a 2% jump. That makes Oregon's per gallon tax rate of 40 cents after the turn of the year. That's pretty expensive. That's, that's so crazy. if you drive something really big, exceeding 26,000 pounds, gross vehicle weight rating, you also get to pay a new per mile tax. That's, we'll put the link below. I actually read, but I don't wanna get into it, but I'll put the link to Oregon's per mile tax. They charge for that also. Before we move on, we want you to put in the comments what state you live in, what is the tax per gallon for both diesel and gasoline. We will tell you what New Jersey is kind of a variable one, but just what it's been every year. If you live in Pennsylvania, you might be a little happy. You're going to see a decrease. So they will be dropping their tax rates a bit. They have a 61.1 cent gas tax. It's going to drop three and a half cents per gallon. So you'll looking be looking at 57 point five cents 57 and a half cents so diesel fuel users you will get a 4.4 cent drop so the diesel tax is higher of course at this point but it's at the present it is 78.5 cents per gallon now west virginia has a more complicated tax calculation they use a fuel tax as, as far as a flat and variable tax, they combine them together. For 2023, the gas and diesel taxes were 37.2 cents per gallon. The fuel tax on both will drop 1.5 cents to 35.7 cents for 2024. The flat rate stays at 20.5 cents, where the variable rate will be 15.2 cents. Now let's talk about New Jersey specifically. I'll just give, give you a little bit of a history because New Jersey used to have the lowest rate in the country. We used to have actually really low gas prices, but of course, you know, we, we found, Didn't last. we, we <laughs> ran out of things we could tax, so we started taxing <laughs> gas more. So here is just a little bit of a history. October 2018, it uh, increased 4.3 cents per gallon. October 2019, there was no change. October 2020, 9.3 cents per gallon increase. October 2021, it decreased 8.3 cents a gallon. October 2022, it decreased one cent a gallon. And in October of 2023, it was 0.9 cent increase. It's kind of based on what the budget is as far as a Department of Transportation. We'll put the link down below if you're interested, but you're probably not. So we're just a couple of days before the Tampa show. We'll be leaving shortly before Within that. Within a week or so. We have sold a bunch of these shirts, guys. People are super excited about them. The RV in the USA shirts. If you can see them, it has the red, white, and blue with RVs. We have this shirt in hoodies, crewnecks. People are asking for windbreakers. We're working on that. T-shirts, of course. And then we have our old logo, plus we have our new hats with the journey of a lifetime. We'll put the link down below for our store. We have these shirts and a whole bunch of other merchandise, including stickers, mugs, pants, anything you want. If you're going to the Tampa RV show, and you're wearing these, we hope to see you guys. If you haven't heard your state listed yet, you might be one of those lucky ones that can just adjust that it may go up or sometimes they have go down. Parameters they have to hit that it can right. adjust. So these are the states that that happens with, and we actually are one of those. So there are 23 states actually: Alabama, California, Florida, Hawaii, Illinois, Indiana, Michigan, Minnesota, Rhode Island, and Virginia, Arkansas, Connecticut, Kentucky, New York, Pennsylvania, Vermont, West Virginia. 
Georgia, Maryland, Nebraska, New Jersey, North Carolina, and Utah. So you could just wake up and there's an increase. We will be driving our motorhome down to the Tampa RV show, Florida Super Show. I will tell you, I just filled it at two ninety two a gallon. Mm. It's way nicer oh, than the nice five now. twenty we were I paying know. I know. a year and a half ago. It's not as nice as in two thousand nineteen, the dollar seventy it cost I us. Remember that? I but, feel like we were back in 1980. Well, I think probably around August, October, it'll be, down, it'll be under $2 again. Mark my words. <laughs> in the comments below, guys, let us know how are the fuel costs by you. I know people on the West Coast, California, you guys get destroyed. Yeah. New York, if you go over the, uh, the bridge into Manhattan, it's, it's like a dollar more a gallon. It's kind of crazy. If you like videos like this, guys, to the left of us, we'll put our RV Newbies playlist. We'll put our RV News playlist. And for myself and MJ, it's a journey of a lifetime. And we'll see, see you, you on, on the road. road. Oh,